Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be doing Get Ready With Me. I'm going out with a friend. I'm going to remove this patch that I have. Oh, That's disgusting. <clears throat> so I usually just start with... Come on. Don't buy this camera. It was $600 and it doesn't even focus. I use this concealer. So I use this and basically you just... I feel like everyone and their moms have tried this. You just kind of like... Pump it up. I don't have much techniques. I just go like this. I use this little sponge thing and I have it like moist. I feel like this, this usually just like rubs away in like two seconds, but... It makes me feel like I'm doing something, you know? Sorry for the background noises. I don't live alone. Bella! I try to like use the excess and just put it on my eyelids because I feel like dark circles are all around. So I just I just put it on my eyelids just in case. Do we look more awake? It's still kind of dead. I could not sleep last night. Like I could, but like I got woken up so many times. Dude, my dog wakes me up, and it's so annoying. I like. If I leave the door open, he'll come and scratch on my bed. If I close the door, he'll scratch on my door until I come and open it. This stupid camera doesn't want to focus on this, but it's the true match from L'Oreal, and I have it in the shade W45. I feel like this one matches me more, so I use this, like, for my face. Like, like if I have something here, I'll, like, use it. I don't really know what I'm doing. Now I'm going to use this. It's basically the Fit Me... Matte poreless powder. And I use it in the shade 220. Also, this one is in the shade 121, which is kind of light. It comes with like this little pressed powder thing and then a little sponge that I like to use. And I don't know how this works, but I kind of put it on and it like kind of blurs everything. So I'll just put it on like this. I don't know. I feel like I kind of use it to brighten my face. I don't know if I'm using it right, of course, but... This could be taking off the concealer for all I know, but it's fine. I'm sorry if I was out of focus that whole freaking time. Next, what should we do next? I'm gonna do eyebrows. I use the Benefit Cosmetic Brow Pencil. I kind of just brush all my hairs down. So I can see, like, my natural shape, I guess. And then I'll outline that. Okay, now I'll just brush it up and blend with the brush. That's one eyebrow done. And then I'll do the other one. I'm gonna go do this pottery thing so I can finish painting what I started the other day. And we are going to skate. I'm not gonna wear this. I'm in my pajamas right now. I have this. The NYX Control Freak Eyebrows. And I don't know if it works to be honest. But I like to use it because I bought it. <laughs> I don't really like the NYX Super Glue. It's way too... It kind of feels like gel. Like really harsh gel. Okay. I'm gonna do my eyes now. I use the e.l.f. Waterproof Eyeliner Pen. And I just kind of... Filling it out. I feel like I should be talking. Let me talk about my stick and poke business. I have not mentioned that. I started doing stick and pokes recently. And it's going pretty good, I think. I'm so bad at doing this. People be telling like stories, but I need to focus. I don't know how y'all be doing that. Okay. How's that like? Oof. A bit uneven. I go in with this pencil that I stole from my mom. It says JB or something. JLB, something like that. I just use it on the bottom. Makes my eyes dark. I left my eyelash curler in my car. So I'm gonna go use my mom's. I'll be back. This is my mom's. But I usually use one that I got from Ross, I believe. Guys, look how I look without any piercings. It's actually kind of cool. Like, look at that. Who is that? I'm sorry. She looks so innocent. Uh oh, we got stuck. 
This is the mascara I use. I use the Maybelline Sky High Mascara. The non-waterproof because the waterproof one is really hard to get off and I feel like it rips out every single lash so don't get that one. I'm like almost out of this and I love it. It's great. So I kind of like to start at the tips because I feel like if I start from the base, they'll just all flop down. Okay, there's that. Oof. I kind of look like spiders. There's that. It looks... It doesn't really make a difference here, but it looks great on my mirror, so I'm fine with that. So next I use the Clinique um, Black Honey Almost Lipstick. And so I recently got a blush. I got this blush since it was on sale. But I'll just like do one thing. I hate strong blush. Okay. And then I'll blend it out with this. That's pretty much the makeup look. I'm gonna go change real quick and I'll be back. So I'm basically just wearing this shirt. I'm wearing a black shirt and then I have like another like lace type of shirt over it. Anyways, I'm ready to go. Thank you for watching my video. Make sure you tune in for my next video and bye.